Okay, how's everybody doing this evening? A little bit chilly here in San Diego tonight. In fact, it's just raining a few minutes ago. I know a lot of people are going to say, oh, he's in San Diego. It can't get that cold. Well, it does get kind of cold sometimes, and tonight's one of those nights. So anyway, I want to make a video tonight. I didn't want to miss this evening because I know some people will say, well, he only makes a video when the price goes up and doesn't make videos when the price goes down. Well, I make videos if the price goes up. I make videos if the price goes down because um, I like talking about EOS. And uh, right now, I'm not con concentrated on price. I'm concentrated on where this is going in the long term, and the long term is nothing but up. So I'm not focused on small ups and downs. I mean, that's just markets and the way they work. But uh, overall, I don't see very much downward pressure on EOS. I believe people that own EOS, that hold EOS, believe in EOS. And I think that there's just nothing but good news if you're really clear about it. I mean, if you want to dwell on some of the, some of the things about, oh, you know, how's it going to launch, or if it's going to launch, or some of the stuff like that, well, you can just sit around and twiddle your thumbs and think about that stuff. I don't really care about it, because I know it's going to launch, and I know it's going to launch without any problems. Uh, I know there's a lot of time and money and effort put into this platform, and I know the potential of this platform, and I know that something like launching it is just... Um, it's just inevitable. Uh, it's owned by the community. The community will launch the platform. Uh, the community votes on the block producers, which build the blocks. So essentially, the uh, the people own, own it and they make the decisions uh, how it's run. A true de decentralized system. A system that runs without censorship. A system that runs without fraud. A system that runs without any downtime and a system that runs uh, independent of third parties. So this is truly decentralized computing. I believe uh, Sergey Brin talked about it a little bit earlier tonight about how Ethereum was uh, next level computing or advanced computing. And I think EOS is even more advanced and even more next level computing. I think sometimes people get focused on some of the negative stuff. They get focused about it because they think of about it as a centralized system. This is a true decentralized system, and once it up it gets up and runs, and people see how it operates, I think it will be a lot more clear to people exactly what's going on um, and why this is, uh, Sergey Brin says it's next level computing. I mean, the idea of a smart contract written in code that defines everything about the contract, that makes the contract very, uh, very tight, and... Uh, makes the contract self-executing without any third-party intervention, That's that, that, that alone is you know enough to disrupt, not necessarily disrupt, but change everything, that, or how we do things in the world today. Um, and, um, you know, I think it's really, truly uh, uh, an exceptional time that we live in. Um, and I think EOS is going to change a lot of things. A lot of industries are going to change. A lot of things the way people do are going to change. And for the better. I mean, like, I, I would never, ever, you know, really been that excited about this if I didn't think it was changing things for the better. And I absolutely think it will change things for the better. I think it will make people's lives better. I think it will increase people's standard of living. I think things will change for the better. I think the, the change our economies. People worry and fear about the future and how economies and how things will get done. Well, I think things like EOS... Platforms like EOS is going to make our lives a lot more better, a lot more efficient. So anyway, uh, I'm going to cut it short tonight because it's a little bit cold out. And I don't want it to start raining on me, so I'll talk to you tomorrow.